Hey everyone, I'm just coming quick live at the moment because I feel it's important to talk a little bit about the latest Lionsgate energies and they've been huge. They've been really, really big. I personally just been going through a wave of different um, life challenges. Um, this, this portal um, has shown me a lot that has been transpired um, in deep, deep waves. Um, in the personal arena, I just came out from a, a, a big migraine, um, triggered obviously by emotional stress. Uh, this Lion's Gate serious portal almost, um, my mother almost decides to to ride that back to, to her origin and leave her body here, which um, in my human level or from my human perspective that has been very hard to deal with being so far away from home here in New Zealand and she being down there in Mexico. So um, it's been very, very uh, challenging, of course, to deal with all those um, frustrations of not being able to be there and even if I were there not being able to see her as we've created a, a health system that is broken. It's broken because it's based on separation, it's based on fear and it's based on greed. Um, so while yes my mother is being looked after in the hospital, in a private hospital, um, at the same time um, it's been mental how my sister and I had to be transversing, finding enormous amounts of money really quickly um, for her to get the right medicine and she not being able to get the medicine unless she, uh, we get the payment and it's all really really difficult there's all these systems of control constantly in the way constantly making the path so difficult getting people in desperate in desperation and in fear so it's very very hard to to be the one to walk that um, and at the same time observing imagine if that's happening to me which I believe I've got now the tools and the knowledge uh, to keep myself grounded and and calling in the light and doing my work right uh, this is a path I, I've, I've chosen um, to go through with my mother obviously my family but the people out there that don't have those tools um, it's 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 really hard it's really hard not to lose grip of and, and lose your power it's so easy to lose your power and 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 be taken into these waters um, of a society and a system that we've all supported and created that does not work anymore so this is a confirmation as well it's like it's like getting my feet in or diving into a glimpse of what we really need to move away from and not just move away from but create a new system and a new way of living um, still I think the most painful part for me in this little journey I've been going through is not being able to be with the people that you love when they are sick it's like we have it all wrong we used to be able to be with the people that were sick in our villages with the shaman all together all the year holding the energy for that person and the person recovering with unity and in love now we've got people alienated alienated and um, machines and connection disconnection really while having to deal with whatever they're going through and that's the sad part that's that's what really ached my heart in this in these times and what is still aching is that um, that sense that I that that we're not able to heal together we heal we, we actually are we healing <laughs> that's, a, that's a question are we even healing uh, there's a lot of trauma there there's a lot of issues there and so imagine um, I've been transpiring going through all of this but at the same time I've been obviously monitoring and, and feeling the energetics of everything and this we had a Schumann blackout uh, for, for about a period of uh, 39 hours 
and um, then we had a very big white uh, white uh, energy diamond coming in through the center uh, solar center where we actually were able to capture a, a supernova a, a beautiful flash of new energy and, and, and a new directive is new programming it's an upgrade of the program um, through the constellation of Opicus which is the, the snake bearer um, the rainbow snake the man the humanity the holder of the rainbow tribe this Opicus um, constellation it's the representation of the Aquarius era so the flash was um, spotted on the 8th uh, of August um, and it's an incredible sight to see uh, it's on, on spaceweather.com and also then that flash goes through the portal of Solaris and of course the Sun is now has ejected a, a class 1 um, coronal mass ejection uh, so we're will be keep will keep receiving all this diamond energy and this upgrades after upgrades so hold on to your hats hold on to your hearts keep beaming your light keep connecting to your inner mastery and keep working with your body with your breath with your presence with your energy finding the joy in everything i've been very very blessed here in new zealand even though i've been going through moments of um deep sadness and um frustration with the whole uh, journey of my mother being in hospital but i've been very blessed to have a my uh, a, a big network of people um around me supporting me um my twin flame uh david who has helped me um and has kept my joy and my and love and pleasure in my life and um, pure pure support and I really feel really grateful to be able to to have that so it is very important to keep connecting and to keep creating network of of people around us rather than separating ourselves it's all about being closer to each other rather than distancing from each other so that is a message keep people close to you keep doing your work keep being in your heart the best you can even when you acknowledge your pain even when it's really really hard um, it is possible to go through this if we remember who we are if we can keep breathing and keep knowing that we are being supported not but not only by the family here in, in on earth our human family but our cosmic family and the beautiful energy of cosmic mother and father um, the program the the main the main light program that is supporting existence and we just were sent a beacon and a pure ray of nova blasting light so let's receive that through our hearts and then beam it outwards i love you satnam